Hey guys, to quick look ahead at the events of the week to come, starting the week of February 23rd, they did mess with the schedule so that they could force the new hero into this week, so here we go. Uh, it's very cold lately, I might be catching a cold. Okay, so we start with keys for the new hero Chaslon. Two things to note. One, he is undead. This is now there are two copies per round of keys. So if you're pulling one round, you do get three copies. Second, he does look good as like a, an upgraded ripper, but he may not be meta. We'll need to see how his poison works in the in the meta. Uh, I'm kind of iffy on poison working at all when everything is Satario burst right now, so we'll have to kind of see how he works. The up hero is Chaslon, but you can, if you're crazy, you can change it. You've got Watchman and Kashka. So the hero summon is Chaslon and Aiden. He comes with Hero Awakening that doesn't give you free copies until T5 purple. <laughs> I don't know why they changed this. It was nice to get the extra copy at um, at wherever it was. The extra copies were I forgot already. But now you don't get it without paying a bunch of money. Oh well. You have Hero Trial for a free 5 star. And you have Valhalla. There is no need to convert heroes into Chaslon. So you're just basically pulling Chaslon to earn valhalla points so that you can eventually convert the new hell hero most likely or save them up for another hero at another point in time these these crystals do stick with you and so every 10 you get you can convert one copy of something into the new hero and so on and so forth and i think that's it oh and Val moonstone shop has grail oracle and ragnarok for 500 moonstones pretty much nothing special here ragnarok is completely obsoleted scroll is even obsoleted by m388 and so yeah nothing big here and mythic artifact forging all right so let's get into the regular event can i get a currency yes this is the idle currency this event sandwiches and here is your screen to log i don't know what they did to the art here uh looking kind of creepy but oh well so you trade in either a hundred sandwiches or a hundred cookies if you trade sandwiches you get 30 points and you have a 50 percent chance to get a coupon if you trade in cookies you get 50 points and you have a hundred percent chance to get a coupon here's where the coupons are used but if you noticed you only get one coupon per trade at least that's what i got well, let's go try right now. So here, I got a gold key and no coupon. Here, I got a blue book and no coupon. Great. So I traded three times. I got one coupon the first time. Didn't get anything later. Here is a... I'll get to that after. There is a secret treasure for the cookies. This is where you're going to get the cookies pretty much. But the hero is Freya. So this secret treasure altogether is kind of a pass. And let's see. Lastly, there is the this Aiden boss. So you fight it, and every fight you get one of these chests, and you also get some purple based on how much damage you do. If you do 6 billion, you get the maximum. So you get this based on how much damage you do, plus this chest. And this chest is nothing special, but it does have a 70% chance to get currency. So you get 14 free hits. So hopefully you'll get about 8 of these currencies. And that's about all there is to it. Let's see. Can I just do a quick fight? That's probably as good as I'm going to get with this account. So I did 1.5 billion. And I got... Oh, I got all of these for the first time rewards, and I got the chest. But, 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 what? Where is the first time rewards? Where do you even see that? Like, how do you even see that you got that? So I just randomly got five stars? Like, I can't even see 
where it is that I got those. So I don't know. I assume they're first time rewards for reaching these milestones, but they're not on the list anywhere. So I don't know. Let's try another one real quick. All right, so this time all I got was this. So it is first time rewards for reaching damage milestones, but it's not listed anywhere, so I don't know. Anyway, those chests here, we'll open these, and I got 100 currency, nice. All right, so is that pretty much it? That's pretty much it. So here's your coupon shop. So as you can see, you need, you know, 90 to 100 of these. But based on math, you get 100 sandwiches per day. You get, you have the daily check-in where you only get these 300 sandwiches. There's no more in there. You have the secret treasure, which gives you cookies. And you have the boss, which gives you 70% chance to get sandwiches per hit. So if you work out all of that, the basic math is down there. You're probably going to, even if you buy all of the secret treasure, you're going to end up with maybe 18 coupons and maybe 900 something progress points down here. So you're not even going to reach this five star unless you spend a bunch of money and buy these extra boss hits. But even that's like not guaranteed because it's only seven, each one of these scrolls is only 70% chance at sandwiches. So unless you're spending a bunch of money on this, it looks like you reach pretty much nothing this event. So with your, you know, however many coupons it is you get, which is going to be 10 or less, you can just buy some cubes or something. That's pretty much all you can expect to get. Buy cubes and fill in the rest with purple. So that is all for this event. Sadly, it's kind of a pass, but... Oh, well, it is what it is. We can't always have good events. So moving forward, we have Miracle Eyes for Azathoth. Okay. This random event for an artifact chest, stars, and elite chest. Uh, well, we'll see what this is when it comes. And Heroic Runes for Yig. Oh, my God. Even Yig has fallen. I guess that's not too surprising. Uh, I did want to show one more thing, which was that the Elite Chest in this shop, this is Elite Chest 7, but they took away the number. So even though it's number 7 and it has Chaslon, they took away the number in front. So if you have a bunch of these in your inventory, like if you have the original one that only has 4 heroes and I think 90 Moonstones, uh, it may be easy to get confused with elite chests moving forward so you're gonna have to start paying attention to what's in them all right that is all for this week see you guys next week